Hi. Welcome back to Mindflux. When it comes to personality, you might have heard people refer to introverts and extroverts. These are two of the most common personality types that exist in our world today. But what about ambiverts and omniverts? This video will explore what differentiates these four personality types. Let's jump in. When someone asks you, which personality type do you fit in? Do you often face problems distinguishing between the four types? Well, don't worry. After watching this video, I bet you will be able to distinguish between the four types. Type 1. Introvert. Introverts are deep thinkers who like to spend time alone. Introverts are often seen as more thoughtful, analytical people who enjoy private time and being alone in their own headspace. They are more likely to prefer spending time alone or with one close friend instead of a large group. They may be less outspoken than extroverts because they need time to recharge after social interaction. Introverts usually prefer to focus on one-on-one -on -one interactions or small groups. They often enjoy more private settings and find it difficult to be in a noisy, crowded room for an extended period of time. Introverts can also have a hard time being the center of attention and may feel drained after attending large parties or events where they had to be the life of the party. Type 2. Extrovert. Extroverts enjoy being around other people and interacting with them. They thrive on social situations, such as public speaking or networking for business purposes. They're the life of any party. They also love having fun at being outside in our physical environment. Extroverts are people who gain energy from their interactions with other people. They love to talk, and they often have a lot of friends. Extroverts enjoy socializing, going out, and being the center of attention in groups or at parties. Type 3. Ambivert. Ambiverts fall somewhere in between introverts and extroverts on this spectrum of personality types. An ambivert is someone who has a mix of introverted and extroverted personality traits. They are not as outgoing as an extrovert, but they are more social than an introvert. Ambiversion comes from the Latin word ambi which means both or around. Ambiversion is when one's personality changes depending on what situation they're in. They can enjoy both alone time as well as social interactions when necessary or desired. They're less likely to be overwhelmed by too many people at once, and when they do find themselves in these situations they can usually calm down quickly. Ambiverts are the best kind of people to be friends with because they can participate in any social gathering while still having energy for themselves afterwards. Adam Grant, a professor of psychology at the University of Pennsylvania's Wharton School even argued that ambiverts make better salespeople than pure extroverts due to their tendency towards both talking and active listening. An able expressor both assertiveness as well as enthusiasm, an ambivert is also more likely to listen in order to understand customers better. Type 4. Omnivert. Omniverts are a newer term that's been coined to describe people who fall somewhere between the two extremes of introversion and extroversion on the scale. An omnivert is a rare type of person who can act as an introvert at times and as extrovert. They're flexible with social settings and often act as the perfect balance for introverted extrovert relationships. Understanding the difference between introverts and extroverts, ambiverts and omniverts can help us understand how to better communicate with people. It is important for everyone in your team, from executives to customer service representatives to be able to identify where they fit on the spectrum of personality types, so that you know what type of communication style will work best when working together. That's it for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. Let us know about your personality type in the comment section down below. Don't forget to like and share this video and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for Mindflux.